What's up, time keepers? Me, Tom Game here. We're getting another part of Red Dead Redemption 2. Sir Freddy, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. Alright guys, so today I'm bringing you uh, basically the third part of Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, the first three videos you guys already saw by now is like, I just took the first two hours of the game and just basically split it up in three parts with minimum cuts, just so you get guys get the feeling of the start to get like, into the mood. The next, like you saw the, the next the next videos after that, they weren't the same. I just recorded them and it's, uh, all right one after the other, so I, did, I didn't edit them uh before i recorded the last one so anyway uh so hopefully you guys are enjoying the series so far hopefully you guys enjoy it. just got a new camera so you guys can enjoy that a lot more uh, green screen a lot better and all that stuff so without further ado let's just jump into the next part of red dead so let's go i ain't clean myself in weeks speak don't cry boy speak about your gang <laughs> <laughs> Are you crying? I can't. <laughs> Boy. Whoa, hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I was thinking Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. I just been ridden with them for a Horse while. Horse shit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, it is to tell us what is going on! Ah! Uh, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Geld him. Oh, yeah! What the hell's Geld? Where's, Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. You know, in Imperial Unix was among the happiest and oh most boy. loyal of courtiers. Oh, no, you kidding me, right? Of course. You sick bastard! So, what do you want from me? Well, you are gonna talk. The only question is now or after we got these little fellas off. Okay, okay, listen. I know where old Driscoll is holed up. And you're right. He don't like you any more than you like him. He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious. I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No offense. <laughs> oh, none taken. Okay then, partner. Uh, Why don't you take a few of us up there right now? I got this, Dutch. Should be fun. <laughs> All right, you. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Killed him. <laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. I ain't no O'Driscoll. You sure as shit was. John, Phil, come here. You got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh, we're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies. Let's go mount my horse. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. Look, I'll, I'll give you more directions when we're close. Oh, we gave him to John? Where Come on. Are. John just... up past Valentine. All right. I'll leave. Are we going to go this slow all the way? Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I got to say? I ain't an old Driscoll. You sure look like one, and you smell like... God damn. You smell like one too. <laughs> I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, are you high. <laughs> okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives. I said easy. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. But you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Just over the ridge. 
Something tells me he's gonna yell out or something. Okay, get down. Cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there too. Are these fellas armed? Armed? Drunk? Where are you strangers? Yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. Hey, over there. Someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we ain't got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. Come on. What are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? One by the tree. He's yours, Williamson. Okay. I got him. All right. You know the camp? I left our guide up there. He's meek as a little lamb. He better be. Feather on the log. What are we doing about him? This one's mine. We need done right. Go on and show us then. That's brutal as hell, man. School.
Come on. The guy in the white over there, I think he turns around at some point. Shit. God damn it, John, you're in my way. God damn it, John. I don't think he's going to be in the cabin, though. I don't... I don't... okay. Oh, I forgot to change it and, uh... Oh, Driscoll! Set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here, I swear. I sw I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. All right, then, go on. Get out of here. Hey? I won't kill you. No, I didn't set you up. You lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now, go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there, without you, Como just was going to lose his mind about this. <laughs> so? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. All right, then. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash, then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash. In the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. Oh, there better be some cash. I ain't so bad. <laughs> hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing. Just yet. <laughs> Right you are. Ooh, money. 
Good old 12 spot. Oh, more money clips. Another 10 spot. Another 10 spot. Jesus Christ, we're good. Ooh, there's a nice little shotgun there. Swap for carbine. There was a uh... huh. uh, this is Seamus. He's our new partner. I ain't no such thing. Prospective new partner if he likes us. Liking ain't the problem. Trusting is, as I said. Keep your voices down. I don't All want right. my boss here. This is a sideline. Of course. Look at us. Honest as the day is long. Exactly. I'll tell you what. Let us prove ourselves. Prove ourselves? To this clown? What are you talking about? Good day, Hosea. Good luck with your business dealings. Listen, uh, he's rough and ready and quick with his tongue, but I swear you can trust him and trust me. I'm an old man. You're not old, Seamus. I'm old enough. And you know why I ain't dead? You don't trust idiots. Exactly. We're not idiots. Let us prove it to you. Okay. All right. I'll tell you what. Arthur. Old Bob Crawford and his boys just bought a beautiful stolen stagecoach from upstate. It's in their barn. Now, you go get that, and then we can work together. Who's old Bob Crawford? An acquaintance of mine. So you want us to take out your competition? Well, he, he's not just an acquaintance, but a cousin by marriage. I also want to see if you boys got what it takes. Now, you survived that. Where is he? Well, he's in a farmhouse just northwest of here called Karma de Dell. It's just up the train tracks as you're heading up towards Fort Wallace. There's also some money in that house, but that's your business, not mine. But don't kill nobody. Folks know we ain't intimate no more, and they'll know it was me. But you're fine with us robbing your cousin. By marriage. And yes, I'd love it. You heard the man. Let's go rob his cousin. By marriage. Really? Lead the way. He said the place is just northwest of here. We should go on foot from here. Let's see what we're dealing with. Come on. All right, nice and slowly, folks. There's the house. I see the barn in the back. Stagecoach has to be in there. Okay, let's take a quick look at the place. Anyone around? Yes. Okay. I reckon we can do it now. I'll head over, distract him by putting on a little show while you sneak into the house, find what you can, then get the stagecoach. Or... Wait until nightfall. Sneak in, then I'll get the coach. You can try the house. What do you think? Let's do it now. Sure. All right, then. Don't follow me.
good man. My good young man. Fairly well, fairly well. <laughs> is your father home, son? Sure is. Get him down. Please, get him down here. Get lost, mister. I was lost for many years. I was lost many years. Now I'm not. And you know what? Oh, <laughs> here he is. Are you the father of the house? Sure. Pleasure to meet you. I was just chatting with Junior here a bit. You selling something, partner? I'm not selling, sir. I'm giving it away. <laughs> I was just telling uh, uh, your, uh, Junior, what's your name, sir? Robert Crawford III, sir. <laughs> oh, pleasure to meet you. Oh. My name is Pete. Now don't tell no one because in New York, I'm kind of famous. I want to perform on Broadway. Now that's not important or relevant. I have been saved! I've been found! No, I, I saw it in your eyes. You think I'm a you think I'm a nut for proper the third. Let's make sure we close everything back here. Dance every night. Women adore me. I can nice Never and solid. All right, I uh, just want to my Hosea. Here he comes. You done, Arthur? Yep. Covered my tracks so well, they won't even know I was in there. Good work. Let's grab this stagecoach and get out of here. Get on, dear boy. what I'm doing.
I'm trying, but I'm going super slow on this. Hello, Seamus. We met your cousins. How was it? Fine. Nice people. Mm. Park that thing in here. Quickly. We're done. We got it. Uh, nice work, Hosea. It was mostly Arthur. Like I said, coarse, but competent. Here. Thank you. If you find any other coaches that need selling, I'll see what I can offer you for them. But discreet, you know. Of course. Goodbye, gentlemen. I'm heading back to camp, I think. You coming? Sure. Wait, how much money that gave me? can bring stagecoats now, that's pretty good. Jesus Christ, that was a lot of money in there. Cool. I can sell all my junk over there. Alright guys, that's going to be it for another part of Red Dead Redemption 2. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hit that, fo hit that like button, so we really appreciate it. And also fo hit the subscribe button. Uh, sorry, I'm having a little bit of problem saying it there. <laughs> of course, go follow me everywhere, me time gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and over right here on youtubecom me time gamer, where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern time. Well, thank you so much, guys, for watching, and we'll see you next one. Keep on, keep on.